Oil is once more on the slippery slope. The reason? Saudi Arabia ruled out production cuts. Not many countries are going to deliver, even if they say they will cut production, they will not deliver. So there is no sense in wasting our time seeking production cuts. They will not happen. But US shale producers should not fear this is not designed to push them out of the market. That's the message Saudi's oil minister was keen to send out on Tuesday. So I have no concerns about demand. And that's why I welcome new additional supplies, including shale oil. And let me say for the record again, we have not declared war on shale or on production from any given country or company. Still, the news sent oil prices down 5% on Tuesday as concerns about oversupplies continue to dominate. However, Saudi Arabia has not ruled out production freezes yet and will push for a deal at an OPEC meeting in March. But countries, including Iran and Iraq, are likely to push back against the deal. Currently, it's estimated that between 1 and 2 million barrels are produced in excess demand every day. And although US shale oil production is expected to fall by 600,000 barrels per day this year, without a blanket agreement on production freezes, oversupplies look set to continue. And that means oil prices are unlikely to recover. Brokerage Philip Futures expect prices to trade between $28 and $36 per barrel in the coming months.